Hi parents, Pastor Brett here, and behind me are some amazing kids and youth that helped to make this Kids Church service possible. This is our Cornerstone Kids creative ministry team, and right now we're teaching a series called The Church. Last week we taught that the church is not a building, it's God's people. It's all of us that make this church what it is, and we're so excited to share this series with your children. And Miss Leslie, what did we share today about the church? Well, it's so important that we come to church. You know, I remember when I was a little girl, my dad was so consistent in taking us to church, whether we wanted to or not. We spent midweek there, Sunday there, and I want to encourage parents, listen, I know technology makes it pretty easy for you to watch the service online. Hey, we do it too sometimes, right? But the kids are missing out on such an incredible experience, meeting other people, learning from the body of Christ when they come to church. Let us not forsake gathering together. That's right. So our lesson today was the church loves to meet together. I teach it this way. When the Bible talks a lot about what the church is devoted to as God's people, well, we're teaching the kids that they're loving certain things as members of the church, and that's meeting together. The Bible says in Hebrews 10, 25, let us not giving up and meeting together. Some are the habit of doing this. Even in the early church, there was a problem. People weren't weren't showing up as they should. Mm -hmm. But this is why it's so important. The Bible continues in this verse, let us encourage one another with words of hope. I taught your children today that church is so important. It's because the body of Christ comes together every week to encourage one another and to be reminded of the hope that we have in Jesus Christ. My Bible story today was the Last Supper. If you think about it, Jesus could have done anything the last few hours that he had before he went to the cross, but he chose to meet together. He chose to get his disciples together in one place to encourage and most of all to give them hope. They took communion. And he had those things in his hands and he said, this is my body and this is my blood. And I bet the disciples were like, what are you talking about, Jesus? But then when they saw him on the cross and they saw what he had gone through and what he did for us, they remembered that Jesus said, my body is broken for you. My blood is the blood of the new covenant for you. I taught the kids that today. We took communion as a kids' church and the families here at Cornerstone was a communion Sunday and big church as well. But I believe communion is what brings us together as the body of Christ because we constantly are reminded of what Jesus Christ has done for us. And that is the hope that we have. So basically, why is church important? Because we've got to meet together to encourage one another and have the hope of knowing that Jesus Christ is coming back. He told us clearly, take this communion until he returns because we need to constantly remind ourselves. We live in a world that's full of problems and challenges, but if we remind ourselves and we're surrounded by believers of faith, then we can have courage and we can have hope to carry this message to the world. So you're watching Family Connection. We're Cornerstone Kids. This is Cornerstone Kids. And we love to teach your children about faith so you at home can take what the kids learn and bring it from Sunday to Sunday in your family today. God bless you.